Hey guys. So, um, yeah, today is motherfucking Sunday. And, um, yeah, and tomorrow is motherfucking Monday. It's back to, it's back to work next week. It's back to work next week. Far as in, y'all yeah, know what I'm saying, you know? We apartment hunting. We looking for, you know, and we waiting for our paperwork and things like that. So hopefully everything, you know, comes and manifests by next week you know because i don't i don't i can't wait no longer like i need this paperwork to come by next week you know i need to move i want to move by my birth before my birthday guys my birthday is in june so i want to move before my birthday um my daughter birthday is next month i was gonna say about her birthday but that's it's March now, so, you know, I don't, hopefully, yeah, you know, because it, it can happen, don't get it twisted, it can happen, because it's, nothing is not impossible, nothing is impossible, I swear to God, now that I'm, you know, I know so much information and knowledge, like, this world is magical, this is, nothing is impossible, this world is magical, I'm about to cry, I don't even fucking know why, bitch, I just finished talking to my divine mess. well, not talk. well, yeah, talking to him, but not really talking to him, <laughs> but talking uh, I left a voice message on his phone because he had hit me up. I told you if y'all was watching my other video, he said he proud of me, guys. Y'all know I didn't fucking hear that shit in so motherfucking long. You understand? I'm proud of myself, but uh, my, you know, my mother not here. My father, you know, he, you know, he's sick or whatever. My mother's not here. She's deceased. You know, my daughter said congratulations. You know, whatever. I'm just saying, like, nobody can say they proud of me. Like, my baby father, like, even though we're not together, I don't, you know, but my divine masculine guy, he said that. And then I saw a post then, I saw a post, somebody posted something yesterday, right? Or it was yesterday or today. I saw it, or last night, or it was last night or, or today I saw the post. And it said something like, find you a man, you know, fall in love with a man or you know find a man that's gonna say he proud of you you know he want the best for you you know keep going you got this you know shit like that and i'm like yo that's crazy because he said that to me you understand the other day he texted me and said he proud of me so that made me feel so good guys i swear to god it made me feel so much you know better what the path of leo's men are here Right, he made me feel he made me feel better because I haven't spoken to him. You understand? And y'all yeah, know I haven't spoken to him. And then I told him, you know, I thought he wasn't gonna reply when I sent him that, you know, information. Like, babe, I passed my test. You know, I thought like, oh, I don't fucking care. You know, like I don't business. You know, and he really, and he really do care. Even though he act like he don't care, he really, he really do care. You know. So, um, oh goodness. So it's um. You know, it, it it made me feel way better. And then my homegirl spoke to her yesterday, whatever. You know, she's like, hey, what's up? I told her, like, you know, I'm going to go look at an apartment. It was too small. Da, 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 ray, ray, ray. And then, you know, we was talking. She's like, you're going to find something. You know, she's like, God got, you know, you and your baby girl. They're going to, you know, God's going to find you something just for you. And I feel like that, too, you know. And then she was like, I said, I, know you, I, you, said, I said, you know, I spoke to, you know, my twin flame, whatever. I said his name. She, I'm not gonna say his name. She knows his name. She was like, she was like, you nigga. She said, I'm not going nowhere. She said, I'm not going nowhere. You nigga. She said, that man love you. You understand? And I know that. You understand? Even though I get scared or afraid or whatever, think that the connection is gonna. You understand? We are gonna stop talking or we are gonna fall out. It's like we do, but we always come back together. That's how I know this is my real divine masculine. And that, regardless of you know any negative thoughts I'm thinking or whatever you understand this man is not he's he's not never going nowhere we are we are not going nowhere from each other put it like that i don't want to say he's not going we both not going nowhere bitch because it's not just him me neither you know but it's like we're not going nowhere but we do need to come together but i know like i said i'm going through this right now he's going through his thing we both going through something his birthday next week 
you know, I would like to go out. I don't know if that's going to be possible right now because of the bullshit that's going on. But, um, you know, hopefully, you know, things get better in Devon Tommen. But I was with him for one of his birthdays. That was like last year, I think it was. Last year, the year before last. I was with him for his birthday one time. But like, I actually want to like go somewhere. You understand? Like, when we was at a party, I want to go out to eat and celebrate or whatever. You understand? So I hit him up and told him that. I don't know what he's doing, what he's going to want to do. I don't know. But I put that out there. So it's up to him. But if not, you understand? I'm not going to be, I'm going to be mad, but I'm not going to be mad. <laughs> You know, because that's, that's him, you know, that's on him. If he like, okay, let's do it, then we doing it, you understand? But if he want to play games and not do nothing then and just still be, you know, then, then he got to, you know, wait till he's ready. But, um, yeah, I just slept in my voice. I just told him I love him so much, you know. Because I'm like, damn, I was like, yo, how did this man... This man that I could fucking curse out, be so mad at, aggravated with, this motherfucker, this, that, 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 you understand? And then next, you know, he texted me like, you know, I'm proud of you, you know, um, you know, he's telling me going through something right now, whatever, whatever, and then he like, he loved me. It's like, I was talking to my goddamn father, guys, I swear to God, I swear to God, guys, I felt like I was talking to my dad, and for him to, you know, say that. It's like that, this is the man that, you know, I fell in love with. This is the man that I fell in love with. That other fucking piece of man, piece of shit man, I didn't. The one that wanna play games and say stupid shit, that's not the man. But the nice, sweet man, that's my man, guys. So I just wanna give you a little update. Oh, I just went to go see if the computer store's open. I could print out some paperwork. It's not. It's Sunday. So tomorrow, we got to get back to it. Right now, I'm going to just relax. Try to, you know, ease my mind. Just relax because it's Sunday. And I was going to start going on the computer. I said, you know what? I'm just just take this day off, like, for real. Because yesterday, I even went on the computer and wrote some stuff down. You know, because I got to put the work in. It's not, it's not going to be easy. And it's not going to be impossible either, all right? The universe see me putting that work, so I'm going to just relax today. Tomorrow, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, on a mission, guys. Like, I'm going to be literally on a mission looking for something nice for me and my daughter. I have to get out of here. I have to get out of this. I have to get out of this building. I have to go. I have to leave. I want to leave. I need to. Okay, I love y'all. Stick with me. Stay with me. Um, I don't. My life is not in order right now. So forgive me for the Twin Flame Tuesdays and the Free Fridays Tarot and many other. You understand? Once I get settled down, get my life back, then I can come back on YouTube and start everything back up again. Right now, I'm sorry, guys. Be quiet. Right now, I'm sorry, guys, because I'm not able to do that right now. And forgive me, but I'm having a towel moment. <laughs> I'm having a fucking towel moment right now, so just bear with me, guys. I love y'all. Communicate. Y'all can still communicate and interact with me, okay, on my channel, even though I'm, all right, doing this, doing these things to better my life. Y'all can still interact and talk to me. And if you have any, you know, um, suggestions or advice, okay, if you know anybody that have any, you know, Section 8 apartments, let me know. Okay, because one hand washes the other. We're here to help each other, okay, guys? So I just want to put that out there and let y'all know what's been going on. Peace out. Namaste.